some of the other stuff down the other end, like our Patrons and our 1800. It's been aged for, you know, sort of six months and onwards. So it really gets some good character about it. And they say that a good tequila is like a good scotch. Mm. So um, I use a nice tequila in my margaritas. And um, instead of the traditional using a bit of uh, Contro with the orange, I go for an elderflower liqueur and use some, um, some agave nectar instead of just straight up sugar, which is made from the actual plant that they uh, make tequila out of. It gives it a really nice sweetness to it. So, uh, I think traditionally um, they're quite sour. So I get a whole lot of lime in there. Some people like to have them sweet, so you just obviously think, I ask people, do you like it sweet or sour? Cut more sugar in. My handy little squeezer. Have a bit of lemon in there. Always with a bit of salt on the rim. I do it half rim just in case you don't like salt. And use a nice tequila. This is our traditional Jose. No, it's a liqueur. Liqueur under under thirty percent is a liqueur. I love the Yeah, it's great. Yeah. I've been trying to get one at home for a water bottle, but someone keeps throwing out the lids on me. So. <laughs> so, you know, and then uh, our agave nectar. A lot of people we buy this from health food stores. A lot of people have it on ice cream and stuff. It's almost like this, or it is as sweet as honey. You don't need too much of that in there. It gives us nice, sweet and sour.